Green Acres is the place to be. Farm living is the life for me. Land spreading out so far and wide. Keep Manhattan, but give me that countryside. Green Acres, as most TV aficionados would uh, would would know, starred Eddie Albert and the lovely, though slightly dingy, Eva Gabor. The show aired on uh, CBS TV from September 15th, 1965 through April 27th, 1971, a very respectable six-year run. However, many people are unaware that the show actually had its beginnings um, years, years earlier on uh, CBS radio. Long before the television show, there was Granby's Green Acres. The radio comedy had a very short run, July 3rd to August 31st, 1950, airing on Monday nights. The program had a super cast of giant talent, in my opinion. Gail Gordon played uh, John Granby, and B. Bernadette as Martha Granby. And both Gail and B. had worked extensively in radio. Um, their voices are heard in many, many programs. Later, B. Bernadette played the mom and hostess of the Shady Rest Hotel on Petticoat Junction, um, also from CBS. Gil Gordon's list of uh, performances were indeed extensive. He had uh, been on uh, Fibber McKee and Molly. Um, I believe he pay- played Mayor Latrivia. And um, our Miss Brooks, he uh, played the principal on both television and radio. And he also played Mr. Mooney on The Lucy Show. And there is much, much more to his credit. The Granbys moved to the country to become farmers, leaving behind the life of a, of a bank teller. And also appearing on the show were Louise Erickson as Janice, their daughter, Parley Bear as Ebb, the hired hand, and the show's announcer was Bob Lamond. Interestingly, the characters played by uh, Gordon and Benaderet were identical to the characters they played on the Lucille Ball radio comedy, My Favorite Husband. The only thing that changed were their names. On Husband, they played the characters of Rudolph and Iris, Atterbury. <clears throat> and another item of interest in Granby's Green Acres is that the general store, who is run, uh, which is run by a Mr. Kimball, uh, years down the road on television a series, uh, ha- had a storekeeper much the same, whose name was Sam Drucker. I was surprised when I came across uh, this radio version of the show because so many years separated it from its television incarnation. I loved the characters of the Atterbury's on My Favorite Husband, and it is fun to pretend that they uh, chucked it all, retired, and changed their names and bought a farm. There isn't really, isn't really anything else to say about the radio series, except that it was very, very funny, very, very down-to-earth and homespun. It was a, a short run, but for sure, it was a gem. And you can find the actual episodes here on the Dennis Morrison channel. And uh, I thank you for stopping by, and have a great evening. Hey, while you're here... Why not click that subscribe tab so that you don't miss a single new program from the Dennis Morrison channel. Thanks a lot. Good night and God bless. Green Acres is the place to be. Farm living is the life for me. Land spreading out so far and wide. Keep Manhattan, but give me that countryside.